In this video, I'm going to show you how to convert illustrations or even photos using a free software platform into images you can use for coloring books on Amazon KDP. So make sure you stick around for that. Also remember, if you want to access my free two hour Amazon KDP fast track course, check out globalselfpublishing.com. I'll leave the details in below and you can enroll in that course for free. So let's get into this video right now. I'm looking forward to showing you how to easily convert your images and photos into format that you can use for your coloring books. Let's get into it right now. There's a website called Data Chef. Now I'll leave the link in the description below of this website, but you can go through and have a look at the different features that this website, which is free, you can just go through and choose whether you want to change a image to a woodcut whether you want to change it to someone like van gogh's oil painting the one what we're looking at is picture to line drawing so you select this one and then that takes you to this page here so all you need to do is simply choose an image to begin with so we browse the images i might choose this one right here go back down that's the main image. So this is my image. I had an illustrator that created this image for me for a book. What I need to do then is to choose one of these line options, the pen pressure, and I normally just leave it as white. So let's have a look. If we go to pen pressure number two, we'll just leave it fine pin and, sorry, pen, and then we convert it. And this should come up with something that kids could then color in. Now, if you wanted to make it into say a smooth pen then you can convert that and see if it makes a little bit of a difference for you it might make it a little bit heavier so there we have it if you felt that this was an image that you then wanted to use for a coloring book you can then download that image and then that image is then available for you so you can have a look there and then that brings up the image for you and you can then save it in that size so this might be an 8.5 by 8.5 book kids can then use this to color in. So that's one example of what you might like to do. Let's have a look at another illustration. So if we go to browse again, let's choose this right here. We go to the image. So it's a fairly complex image. Let's go back to fine pen. Let's increase the pressure to three, leave that as white, and then we convert. So we wait for this to convert then this will give us an illustration in which kids could then color in again. So it's nice and easy. Again, free. What you then would do is download that image. Let's do one more for illustration purposes. We'll go to this image right here. So we've got the image of a child at the beach with a teddy bear. I'm going to leave it at pen pressure three. We could change this up if we wanted to. Let's try a colored pencil just for this and see what happens. So we wait for this to convert and it's going to be very different to what we had before, but it'll just give you an idea of what different options you have with this software. So see how it gave it provided the outline, but it was a colored pencil outline. So we could go to smooth pen and we can convert this. Again, you might like to go back to the original image and convert it. But if you stayed on the same image, then what we'll do is convert those color lines to this. So it doesn't come up as well as what it could with the previous image. And not all images are going to come up as well as other ones. But it'll it'll be a good way for you to, to do that. So we'll go back. We can do a sample image. So you can see the sample image if you wanted to. And you can see before and after. And that what might might be what you're looking for that would be a very very complicated coloring in page or picture but you can you can see if you have a photo what that can do so i'm going to go and choose a photo and if i go to browse it's a photo of a place in new zealand that i recently went to so we can see this and we're going to go to find pen we're going to put it back to restore faults white and let's see what a photo comes up like for this software where it actually will pick the different elements to make it into a uh, something we can color in so you probably have to be careful here i think maybe if you made it into say a, a tree or something like that 
or if you had a picture of a tree, you could probably color that in. I'm going to try one more photo and let's see if that actually works. So let's choose this photo. I've got a pair of shoes. This is a photo I took a few years ago. So what we're now going to do is convert this and see what it comes up with. If it's just a simple illustration, sorry, a simple photo that we can convert into an illustration. So let's wait till it comes up. Well, this is saying that someone can color in. So it's pretty good. You can see how you probably needed a bit even more simpler, but it's a great free source that you can use online you can go image to sketch so this can change it again so if we go to that same image we can go to that one choose it and we can convert it and there's another number of different options that you can choose from depending on what you're looking at creating but that's a sketch one as well but mainly if you're looking to convert different images into coloring book images then you can do that. We're going to go back to, uh, where is it? We go down on the side here, and it is this one right here. And this one will convert those images into the coloring in pages that you might like to use for Amazon KDP. So as you can see, it's nice and simple to convert your pictures and illustrations into usable images you can use for um, coloring books for Amazon KDP. So just a reminder, if you want more resources and everything to do with Amazon KDP, to check out my website, globalselfpublishing.com. Have a good look around and see if there's some resources and tools you can use for your self-publishing. And also remember to sign up to the Amazon KDP Fast Track course for free. That will show you all the important steps to publish successfully with Amazon. So until my next video, I look forward to seeing you then.